Hello everyone. In this presentation, you will learn how to solve a linear programming problem. These are the steps to solve an LPP. Firstly, we frame the LPP. Then, we graph the equations. Then, from the graph, we determine the feasible region and the corner points. Next, we find the objective function z at corner points. Finally, we select the optimum corner point. Let's understand this with an example. A company sells two different products A and B. It makes a profit of $40 and $30 per unit of A and B respectively. It takes three hours to produce a unit of A and two hours to produce a unit of B. The production process has a capacity of 3,000 man-hours. A market survey anticipated maximum demand of A and B as 12,000 and 8,000 units respectively. To summarize, the objective here is to maximize profits, and the constraints are man-hours and market demand. Firstly, we frame the linear programming problem. Let number of units of A to be produced be X and number of units of B to be produced be Y. Since the objective is to maximize profit, the objective function we get is maximize Z equals 40X plus 30Y as profit made on each unit of A and B is $40 and $30 respectively. Now, we consider the various constraints. Firstly, we have limited man hours, as it takes 3 hours to produce a unit of A and 2 hours to produce a unit of B and the production capacity is 3000 hours, we get the equation 3x plus 2y less than equal to 3000. Second, from the anticipated market demand of 12,000 and 8,000 units for A and B respectively, we get x less than equal to 12,000 and y less than equal to 8,000. Finally, since we cannot produce negative number of products, we take x and y to be greater than equal to zero. We then graph the equations of constraint. Non-negativity implies that the feasible region will be in the first quadrant. The region under the constraint equations in the first quadrant thus forms the feasible region. We next determine the corner points, which in this case are A0, 1500, B1000, 0, and O0, 0. Next, we calculate Z at the corner points which comes to be 0 for point O, $40,000 for point B, and $45,000 for point A. Since we had to maximize the profit, the optimum solution is point aware 1500 units of B are being produced and the profit achieved is $45,000. Thank you for watching. I hope this was a useful presentation.